So when it comes to health and fitness, strength training for women is a must. They've been telling me this for years. <laughs> they say building lean muscle can raise your metabolism, boost your body's immune function, and increase bone density. This morning, Local 10's Christy Kruger has a look at some of the simple moves that can maximize muscle tone as long as they're done the right way. Virginia Oliveira works out nearly every day, but even in her top physical condition, one wrong move meant trouble. I was in physical therapy for about six weeks and very, um, a lot of pain. Bring it up, please. Good. Personal trainer Crystal Richardson says what happened to Virginia is not unique. I see it all the time in the gym and I just cringe and as a professional, it is my job to correct somebody only because um, injuries happen and when they happen they can affect you for a long time. When it comes to ab work, doing sit-ups like this can wrench the lower back and put strain on the neck. Instead, Crystal suggests using an exercise ball to support the lower back and do smaller lifting movements keying in on the stomach muscles. So you're only crunching up probably a quarter of the way instead of to a full sit-up. Virginia demonstrates a common mistake with a standard push-up, not keeping the lower back flat, which puts a strain on the mid-back and the shoulders. Crystal says a safer option is a modified push-up from the knees. You're getting just as effective of an exercise doing that. When working the shoulders and the lats, Crystal says a pull down or press behind the neck can cause injuries to the neck and the rotator cuff. Simply doing the move in front of the head reduces the risk of injury dramatically. And for working the hamstrings and the glutes, avoid the deadlift, which can put a strain on the back, legs, and sides. This alternative move with a handheld weight can provide better results without the risk. It's much more stable and you're getting, you'll actually probably end up getting better results as a woman because you can concentrate it's more of an isolation movement. Virginia says her own experience with injury has taught her that some simple adjustments can really help her avoid injury and maximize her workout. It was a very well-learned lesson. And the pros say proper warm-up before working out and stretching after are also key factors for avoiding injury. Your time is now 620.